So this little video is for those of you that are struggling with pad placement. I've thoroughly cleansed the eye area and the lashes so that we can make sure that those pads will really, really stick to the skin. If you leave any product at all on the skin, you will find that the lash pads will not stick, whether it's even a tiny little bit of moisturiser, powder, bronzer, foundation, make sure you, that you remove that product completely away from the skin before you attempt to pop your iPads on. Okay, so we've just removed all of that. Now, these are the pads that I absolutely swear by. They're literally just from eBay and they're fantastic. So the first thing you're gonna do is get both of those out. And you're gonna ask your client just to open their eyes not even necessarily look up towards you, just open them and make sure that they feel really relaxed. Take this bit. So if you can just open your eyes for me. And then what I like to do is just gently pull down there. Let that sit on the lower lashes and close down for me and then gently pull that pad across so that it sticks really nicely and sits in place on the skin. Another little tip that you can do is gently pull the pad before you place it. So give that pad a little tug. Just open up for me. Pull the skin down. Place that pad in place along the lash line. Close down for me. And then gently pop that into place. You need to make sure that all those lower lashes are covered. If they're not covered, then when you start applying the eyelash extensions, you will find that you get a little bit of um, adhesive onto the lower lashes and they will stick together. So those are all cleansed now. And I'm just gonna give them a little brush through just to make sure that there's absolutely no residue of any mascara on there at all. Before we can start applying some extensions. So just give them a gentle brush through. You can see here that Sasha's got the remnants of a few volume lashes. But you can see how clean that they've got to be before you start applying anything. If the lashes are in the correct place, they shouldn't move throughout the whole of the treatment. Hope that helps.